Hello again, everyone. So, this is the Self-Care Rituals Oracle by uh, Goddess Provisions and Tatiana Ven... Veden... Vedenkina? Vedenkina. This is the um, indie deck version. So, this is the one they did on their own and published it. I found this, actually, secondhand <laughs> on an app called Depop. There's a girl, she somehow she accidentally got three copies and she was selling them for like not like a ten euro because she was like, Here, do you want this? And I'm like, sure, whatever. So I got the indie one because the mass produced one's coming out in January with the book and everything. But I just wanted the indie one because it's a nice little small deck. It's small and it's cute and it's um it's just nice. You don't need the book. I, I I feel like you wouldn't really need the book. There's the art on the inside. Look at that. I think she's asleep there. I've been using this all week on my Instagram. I've used it for myself. And it's such a nice deck to go, what do you need to work on for today? They shuffle beautifully. The card stock is so thick. Now, it's not or like an Oracle deck thick. How would I put it? It's not... um. A thick tarot deck there. Um, I used to, I did sell this now, but the um, oh, what's it called? The Moon Child Tarot. It's not as thick as that, but it's still like a decent card stock. It's semi matte because there's a slight gloss to it. I'm gonna say satin. <laughs> it's satin. It shuffles nicely. It's about the same size as a a tarot deck, I'd say. So it's not too big. Um, let me just guess. Where is it? Oh, here. Centennial. We'll always go with Centennial. I'll just pull a card out. What's the card? Oh, two of cups. Okay, so. They're roughly the same size, just slightly off. So it is the size of a tarot deck. And shockingly, this one's thinner than this. So that helps you there with the concept of it. It's thinner than the... It's thicker than the Centennial. I always use Centennial. It's a great deck. So let's get into this. This is the goddess... It's the... Mm, sacred... The whole name. I just say self-care oracles. like sacred self-care rituals oracle deck. It's such a nice deck. Like, I'm going to tilt this this way and you see that of course you do nope that does not work right. so you have this ring on the back of my phone now so it's really hard to balance it so and it's un unedited because I don't have an editing thing on my phone grabbing visualisation look at this and the backing is this lovely, like, design. I might actually get that on my neck. The back of my neck. It's really pretty. Write a gratitude list. So it's like, instead, like, if on your field, you're going to write things you're grateful for rather than the pros and cons. It's just the pros. Like, that's a great thing. Journal. So, like, work on your bullet journal. I have my bullet journal here. It's a massive thing, though. I got this off Amazon not knowing how big it was. It's huge. So, yeah, I'm working on that. It's huge, though. <laughs> so I went, I have it. I might as well use it rather than getting a small one. So use up that one and then get a new one when it's finished. Watch a movie. See what I mean? Like, there's some things in here that you just do on a daily basis. And I love it. Because, like, what makes you feel better in self-care? Watch a movie. Or that, yeah. Thanks, Bob. Thanks, Bob. I like how it's just this rainbow thing and there's like this just ripple effect of colours. Well, you know, if you... I'm just saying, if you can. Not everyone has that available to them. Drink tea. Connect with animals. I just don't run into the zoo and go, animals, they're my friends. And then you get mauled by a tiger. Don't do that. Just stick with the pets, you know. <laughs> clean your space. So clean up the room. Declutter. 
Oh wow, intuition. I love how the little goddess is there. Connect with water. Water's very therapeutic, so if that makes sense. Connect with your ancestors. So maybe meditate, find out your family roots. Connect with fire. Same with water, like fire keeps you warm and cozy and safe. Water's very cleansing. Connect with your womb. If you have one, do you know? I always say that if you have one, because guys don't have one, obviously. But maybe I would say connect with your feminine side if this comes up for guys. Wow. It's amazing like what they come up with. Create art. I've been using this deck and I have not seen those two cards. Oh my god. Oh dear. Look for fairies. I love my fairies. Aromatherapy. So put those incense on, candles. I actually might put a candle on after this. Abundance planning. So budget planning, basically. And it has the little cat. Look, I have my little cat here. He's just there. He's so cute and chubby. He's just there. I don't know where he came from. I think he's in like a goodie bag of crystals. Rest. Health checkup. I've done this one on my Instagram. It's very important to do your health checks, especially ladies, when you get that letter to go and get checked, go and get checked. Don't just work is not the be all and end all. OK, because don't be sacrificing so much for a job that can easily replace you. Simple as so go and get those health checks. Hydrate. Wow. Dance. Breathing. Oh, massage. Oh, we all love a massage. I only do the head. Oh, I was like, what was that? I sound like a dog going, like, I don't know. Oh, it's just next door doing DIY on his bike. Of course he is. Um, I always get the head, neck and shoulder, head, neck, shoulder and back. So it's just this part here because that's the bits you use the most like I have gotten I have gotten a Swedish massage once before a full body one oh my god if I was a guy you'd be shitting it I couldn't relax because they start at your groin and I go why did you start my groin why uh, pleasure so this is the one if you uh, couldn't access the one before <laughs> it's nice though I like how there's all this like flow colors chanting so ohm with all that stuff the ohms positive affirmation brave beautiful worthy grateful happy healthy i love myself i choose love it's so nice all the things written on there use your hands so maybe for self-care maybe go off and do some crafty like knit or um go to a pottery class and make something like you want to make something with your hands you know what I mean? or cook baking's one as well like when you use your hands build strength go to the gym maybe movement wow beauty ritual i'm like that myself like do you know those days where you're just like i need to relax to relax so i would do the whole shebang. You go shave your legs. You shave your arms. You have the shower. You wash your face. You wash your hair. And then you go out and you put a clay mask on. or And the nose strip. And then you do a sheet mask. And you're just like. Oh, I'm so chill right now. And once you finish all that you have to do your hair. And I don't make my hair. I haven't straightened my hair in about. Seven or eight months. Oh my god it's so healthy like. So doing those kind of small rituals, like straightening my hair is great when I'm in the mood for it. But sometimes I'm like, I just don't want it to be, I want it to be thick and fluffy and just nice. But it's like putting those hair masks in, you know, that kind of thing. Whoa, that really connected with that one. Maybe I need to do it next week. Nourish your temple. So you, your body is a temple. You are the temple. Be still. Oh, that's like doing a mindfulness thing because she's doing the hands up thing. That's a mindfulness pose. 
Yeah, I, that, I would say do a meditation for that one. Music. Listen to music. Clean your energy field. If I'm allowed to have sage in my room, I'm not. I only have incense sticks of sage because they're safer than walking around with a smudge stick. Um, but one day when I get my own place, I'll be using my smudge sticks. Look to the stars. Connect with Earth. We are family. Sweet treats, see baking. Sweet treats, go and make cupcakes. Energy work. The colours in this are so nice and pastel. There's no shading, it's just flat colours. It's beautiful. Make a vision board. I actually want to do one of these. I need to make a vision board, but I might make a video about it. And just have all the stuff here and just film it and then talk over it. Plan a vacation. I have been putting this off myself. I just don't know where to go. Read. Burning bowl ritual. Oh yeah, like that burn baby burn from Valentine's Day or the one that Rachel and all from friends did. Time with friends. Connect with the moon. So it's maybe during the full moon do a meditation during it. Sound healing. Meditate. Wow. Create an altar. I've done that so when I if you already have an altar and this card came up, I'd say maybe just rejig some things like move things around. There's nothing wrong with change. Give it a cleaning, dust it down, that kind of thing. Give it all the clean and then just rearrange things so that maybe just give it a fresh look. Connect with crystals. Hey, connecting with the crystals. I love my crystals so much. I've been really into my crystals again lately because beforehand it was just tarot, 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 tarot. So now the decks that are being flipped throughs now are like <laughs> recently, it's just all oracle decks. I'm on an oracle kick. Because I've done a huge clear it, so I just want more architects. <laughs> and they're just so pretty. So, dream journal. I have one of these. <laughs> I got the most random journal. It has flamingos on it. And I went, well, it's random. So, because my dreams are really random. I need to write down some I've had. Like, there's one where um, I was ignoring people. But they were trying to talk to me. And I was like, nope, nope, not today. Um, there were some that were very vivid and I was like, Ooh. take a bath if you have a bath. <laughs> Not everyone has a bath. <laughs> um, so yeah. Sing. So sing in the shower, baby. Make a meal. Cooking is very therapeutic as well. Alone time. Take that time for yourself and take a walk. It's a really nice deck. Oh, there's two here on their own. Oh yeah, write a gratitude list. I've put them there on my room. You're probably like, she put it upside down. How dare she? Um, let's see what comes up for you guys. That's another way to do it. Just let it fall rather than um, curling them. Connect with crystals came up. I knew that was going to come up. I had a feeling. So, this is a good like segue then because I have new crystals. I have some um, Sugulite. No, Sardonyx. This is Sardonyx. So, if you, I watch Steven Universe, guys. So, if you watch that, that's amazing just to get the idea. Because the personality of Sardonyx is just perfect. She's confident. She's like, oh yes, I'm brilliant. Oh, but she's like a bit... There's, there's confidence and then there's arrogance. So it's really nice though. Like that piece. I got this from the lovely ladies at Rocky, Ro Rocky Road Minerals. Uh, this is Monica and her sister is... Oh my God. I can't remember her sister's name. Dominique, I think. And she's called Pearl of Ireland on Instagram so it's pearl dot of dot Ireland. I'll put all the links below. Um but it's just amazing what they did. They got like they know me so much from the last one. They're like, you're here 
before and I went yeah so I said I was looking for moonstone and they, had, they gave me this bit I've, well they didn't give it to me they showed me the little tray and I just picked this one I don't know why it's just this smooth side like a corner piece but it's just really nice and smooth here to hold I was looking up things that cancerians should have and it's rose quartz amethyst and moonstone and I didn't have a piece of moonstone so so I need to put these three together uh, the moon and a bit of amethyst. No, a bit of um, rose quartz. So I'm gonna put it. I think I'm a bit in here. In the depths of beyond, I have a bit of rose quartz. There it is. See, tiny bit. That's all. There are the bits there for cancerians. I was looking them. Up. I think it was a post on. Oh, my friend Kay Aliquist. Aliquist. Oh my God. Her, her username is just so bizarre to pronounce but these are the three that Cancerians should be car carrying so it's real nice um, so yeah they got I got these two pieces off the lovely ladies this was eight euro and I think this was like four I think it's so they're so reasonably cheap like priced and yeah so I was connecting a lot with my crystals this week a lot this week so it's nice to reconnect with them ah dropping everything so it's just nice to reconnect with crystals and there's another one here this is a heart piece of heart shaped um obsidian it's been rolled into a heart or uh, rolled <laughs> and this is from jenny's crystals and she's amazing she's irish based and she did a deal for me so i got three for like pricey two or something like that. i can't remember i have a uh, blue howlite here that's just beautiful. All this like, they're cold though. Wow, they're really cold because the, the wall to the outside is just here, you see. And this is not a uh, tiger's eye, this is tiger iron. Tiger iron is where, I think, I can't remember the name of the other crystal, but it's another crystal that's merged with it. And therefore it became tiger iron. So these three heart pieces are in the background now. And they're, they're lovely pieces, like. Um, they're really nice to hold like this one's really warm not from my hand but just from taking it up like it's really doing its work like it's warm because it's doing its job um and then i think that's it for now because i've only done a little small update with crystals so i've been connecting with my crystals so you guys need to connect with your crystals i'm not sure if they post outside of ireland but there they are there there's their email stuff um, I will put their links to below, but they mostly go from uh, Instagram. So I will put their Instagram stuff up there on Etsy as well. Um, I will put Pearl of Ireland as well. There are this this is a family. Uh, there's two sisters and the mom, and they do the whole thing. That they, <laughs> they're amazing. Like, so guys, go and check them out, and I will see you all very soon. Bye.